you know you've officially transcended into a washed up alcoholic piece of shit when you're intoxicated unacceptable actions no longer bring you shame you throw up on yourself and shit your pants and somehow manage to wake up in a brown suit you go to work with black eyes and no one says anything they are hip to the fact that it's just another day in the life until they get out of your company then joke and theorize what really happened to you my parents and other people jokingly say I'm surprised you're still alive when I see them or call them but in reality it really is more surprise than joke you know your image is more than tainted when people say don't be like refined white trash don't end up like refined white trash your name is an ill reference it's like you're some intoxicated legend or a mythological lush then there are some people who only call you when they want to get fucked up because that's what refined white trash does he won't judge me when I get a case of the fuckets he will embrace them with me then their girlfriend or relative gets mad at them for doing some fucked up shit and blames me that's what you get for hanging out with refined white trash you're lucky you ain't in jail it's like I kidnapped them forcibly poured the liquor down their throats and brainwashed them into doing dumb shit there comes a certain age when you are too old and expected to be wise enough not to use excuses excuses are for spoiled rich affluent kids I was drunk hi baby it's not my fault if you had a girlfriend with an ounce of self-esteem she would go judge Judy on your ass bad fluences don't exist it's you you're fucking incorrigible but I guess I'm like a herpes infection I come around every once in a while to annoy these women one girl told me I only get drunk and wild when I'm around people I know it's too embarrassing to get drunk in public fuck that I'd rather do dumb and crazy shit around people I don't know and will probably never see again I've got crazy and drunk mirrored times around people I know why do you think I don't have many friends I'd rather horrify and traumatize strangers. And if the day comes and you are burnt out of being a piece of shit and want to be reborn and rise anew like a phoenix, you are going to have to become a softer and squishier piece of shit that people can step on for your first part of redemption. And as a soft piece of shit, you're going to have to stick on a good people and stick up their reputation if they take a chance on you. Not being an addict, changing your habits, and learning shame is part of the game. And instead of being something that came out of someone's ass, you're going to have to start kissing asses. From being a piece of shit to a bar of gold. It ain't easy being an alchemist, baby. When an addict says they are going to change tomorrow, it's as promising as a sign in the bar that says free drinks tomorrow.